Also, uh, the FCT minister, Yesung Wike, on a visit to the collapse site, directed the FCTA permanent secretary, Olu Shade Adeshola, to facilitate the prompt payment of the victims' bills. The acting secretary of the Health and Human Services Secretariat, Malam Nur Haruna, led the top officials in the administration to the Sokoro District Hospital and four other hospitals where the victims were receiving treatment. We have seen what has happened and currently about 31 of them have been discharged and two of them died and then four are still in the hospital and we have all visited them, we have seen the condition and we have instruction of the minister to ensure that they are well taken care of and then they should write the bills and forward them through FEMA to the health secretary for onward submission to the permanent secretary and subsequently to the minister. Work on it up now. So that's why it's telling me to cover my leg like this for like three days. Up to now, I'm not going to do anything for my leg. So that's why it's telling me. Okay, I mean, did you leave in that building or you went to get something there? Yeah, I was, I was going there as usual any, any time because I have my friend there. So most of the time in the night, when I go, when I come back to the market, so I went there so that I have my friend there. So when we discuss about uh, uh, for down before we go off stage, so around by 10 o'clock, we will go off stage together with them. After some one hour, two hour, and I will be coming back to my room and sleep. So that I did do any time. After 11 in the evening, the tragedy occurred. So in the process, that is how in the process he got uh, himself uh, in fact, he was injured, so we rushed him to the hospital. At the end of the day, uh, he was. Uh... Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.